L'orientation. This is something which is seen as being really, really important in education, and it's particularly one of the things in the current policies they're stressing, that in order to avoid the amount of dropouts that there's been, le décrochage scolaire, whether it's within a school or in higher education, it's really important that people know where they're going, what direction they're going, whether or not they're equipped to do that. So l'orientation is something you'll hear an awful lot at the moment in school circles, in education circles in France. So orientation from the word l'orient is the east, the idea of taking your bearings from heading east, I suppose. And I think we talk, we talk about it in um, our country as IAG, information advice and guidance or careers guidance. So I'm talking about it now in the context of le collège, the end of the collège and deciding where you're going to go next. Donc sur le site, l'orientation en troisième et l'affectation en lycée. Donc l'orientation, so careers guidance in the third year, or taking your bearings, I suppose, taking your bearings in the third year. Notice that troisième, I've been writing, haven't I, with an E with an accent M-E, but it seems that three E is the way that they, they do it, and a capital E, if it, well I suppose this is because it's in capitals, otherwise it comes a little at the top. Et l'affectation au lycée is the placement into a uh, lycée, which is the upper secondary school. So they've come to the end of the, uh, coming to the end of the uh, lower secondary school, and they've got to decide where they're going to go next. Tout au long de la classe de troisième, and that's answered my question, you can just have a 3E. So throughout the um, third year, no, uh, the year 10, l'élève précise son projet personnel et se prépare à une filière d'études. So there, you know, you're managing to be more precise about your own plan, your personal plan, and you're preparing yourself for, I suppose here, a course of studies. So you're going to choose what course you're going to go on. So it's a collection, what collection of subjects you're going to go to follow. L'année est jalonnée de moments forts pour l'orientation en vue de la poursuite de la scolarité au lycée. So the year is and punctuated. Un jalon is a milestone or a marker. So there are a mark particular, particularly important times for l'orientation, for taking your bearings or deciding where to go, according to what sort of schooling you want to have at the lycée, which is the next stage. So what will happen, you'll have entretien personnalisé avec le professeur principal. So you'll be having a personal talk with the professeur principal, like the tutor. Choix d'une voie d'orientation, you'll be choosing which pathway, which route you want to go. Et vœu d'affectation, and what is your desire for the placement dans un établissement scolaire, in which type of school. And then your inscription au lycée, then you'll sign up to the school. So it's preparing for deciding which school you can go. You'll have your teacher helping you. You'll say what you want to have. And then the decision is made as to which placement you'll get. And then you'll sign up. So if we just click on this, this takes you to the site where you've got much more detail there about um, how you get ready. And it's something where there are loads and loads of resources now to help people on this. Um, the site that I talked about, the Onicep site, is packed full of videos and ideas. Uh, you know, they really do want them to be able to make the choice which is right for them as to what to do. So you can go onto the YouTube, there'll be things that you can see there. Um, and here this tells you what stages you go through for deciding on your career path. So, le temps de ré la réflexion, think about it. Le temps du dialogue, talk about it. Le temps du choix, choose and then l'affectation au lycée, then the placement dans votre académie, in your authority, in your local authority. So there again, first stage, second stage, third stage, more loads and loads of detail given to you for this, which is a really, really important part of your schooling and your decision making. So returning to my PowerPoint, there we are. I've just done a copy and paste of Les étapes, the stages which they talk about. À la fin de l'année de troisième, so at the end of troisième, les élèves présentent. So they then submit le diplôme national du brevet, their diploma, 
et ils peuvent s'orienter vers « they could go towards » either une classe de seconde en lycée général et technologique, um, a year 11 in a general technological school, secondary school, or une classe de seconde professionnelle, or you could go to a, a year 11 in a professional school, a vocational school, ou une première année de préparation au certificat d'aptitude professionnelle. Or you do the first year of preparing for a certificate of um, your professional skills. What about the placement, l'affectation? What does it depend on? So it can depend on what sort of school you want to go to, but also, as well as that Diplôme National du Brevet, which will take account what result you got for that, This also can be determined by le livret scolaire de l'élève. So that school um, report card that's been going with you from primary right through to the end of year 10 may be a determining factor to decide on the placement. So I'm giving you information now, but there's obviously an awful lot to discuss because as in, any, you know, as in our country as well, there's this idea to what extent are you free really to choose where you want to go, to what extent are you going to be bound by tests or by what other people say you ought to do. There are lots of resources available for families and students to make this decision about what they're going to do. So here you could download a pamphlet, Fascicule d'information, which gives you information and that's given to the troisième. Um, you could also download a PowerPoint presentation, which is done to the, it says aux parents d'élèves, to um, the, the parents of the students, but it's also for the students. So that's from the um, EduSchool site. Présentation aux parents d'élèves de troisième. Oh, notice the way they say the third there. So there they have got the M. <laughs> so if you click on that, you'd be able to download. I'm actually going to show you quite a lot of those slides when I talk about the different lycées. And they've got a, a site which is dedicated to quand je passe le bac, so taking your baccalaureate, um, something for the seconde générale et technologique, so when you're in the general and technological school, what could you go to? And if you go for the professional um, route, what could you go to? So these are really very attractive, accessible sites so that people can find out a little bit more about their choices.